money everyone, I'm Mike and uh, I'm one of the co-founders of Trade on Chain. So imagine you have a small business and you are ready to ship your goods worldwide all over the world. And instead of enjoy the journey with the right product, the right buyer and the right market, you are stuck on dozen of paperwork, manual and process to follow. Now imagine a world where trade, international trade are immediately fast and uh, secure and transparent. This is exactly what we are doing in Trade on Chain. The international trade industry is broken. Considering that the 55% of international trade are going to arbitration every year just because they don't do a proper contract. The main issue is centralization then uh, there is a huge problem of lack of transparency, considering that you are dealing with someone that is on the other side of the world and you don't know him and you don't know which is the past experience that they had. And then there is a complex compliance requirements, considering that in import-export, the law between the two parties is the contract and nobody cares about it. So they send an email and they thought that it's fine. What we build is a fully decentralized platform for international trade. We moved on ICP all the process from inter, um, identification, fill, sign, a pay an international contract. How we did it is to work together with our three key partners that are the European Union that granted us at the beginning, ICP that provide us the technology to do that, and uh, ICC, that is the International Chamber of Commerce, that is a private organization that decides the rule of the market uh, globally. So we moved the standard on blockchain, make everything easier for the small medium enterprise that want to approach an international market. The result is that we simplify all the process and make, uh, of course, cheaper, and uh, um, much more simple and ready to use. Our unique value proposition is that we are covering uh, the complete life cycle. So we are not covering a piece of that that is available already on the market, but we are covering uh, the full life cycle. Then, uh, of course, we are a blockchain native project. So we build from the first time on ICP. And we have an institution validation. So working together with the European Union from the beginning give us a fully compliance uh, structure from the identification that it was the key. And of course, we are focusing on a small medium enterprise. We are not interested in big corporation that maybe have some ad hoc need, but we want to support the small medium enterprise that globally struggle to access the international market. Of course, as I mentioned, internet computer was key for our project, considering that in our platform, the identification is through internet identity that have the highest standard required by the European Union. And of course, uh, we had the possibility to store all the documents in the same place. So the small medium enterprise doesn't need to go on different platform to check a step and then globally um, integrate it. And we are perilous by design. Uh, an international trade contract with all the manual and document could be more than 10,000 page. So everything, uh, having everything digitally could help a lot, not only the environment, but the, the client. And the business model is quite simple. So what we are requesting to, the small, to, the, to our client is a percentage based on the value of the contract. So just to give you an example on a $50,000 value, we are going to ask just $250. And I don't know if someone of you is in this business, but a simple legal um, consultancy service could go up to $10,000. The opportunity is huge. We are talking about 350 million uh, small medium enterprise worldwide and uh, 45 million of that are 
associate with our main partner that is the International Chamber of Commerce. And the, usually the average international contract value for small medium enterprise is $100,000. This is just to give you an overview of our partner. Uh, so we are part of the ICC um, UK. So we are sit on the table of the digital trade. So we are discussing with them the rule of international trade. We are member of different chamber of commerce globally from Hong Kong and Dubai. Of course, uh, ICP was our key. And um, this is the team. Uh, Steven is our CEO with a decade of experience in international trade, as well as our uh, CFO. And then Massimo, our CTO, is uh, the person that make everything happen with our past experience in one in the biggest uh, enterprise in Italy as uh, Pirelli or Enel. And then me, but I don't want to talk about myself. And the roadmap is really challenging, but it's exactly what we have uh, uh, working for the next uh, two years. Um, the product is ready and will be um, marketed from next week uh, through the um, Chamber of Commerce of Hong Kong. Then we are moving on the audit, but the key is to integrate the custom system. So the idea is to integrate even the, um, the custom system to track the step and eventually the issue that could be there. And uh, the next one are more on uh, the uh, market side. We are going to open an office in Hong Kong and London because we consider the two main markets in the world. And thanks for the attention.